Hello, my friends, and welcome. Thank you for taking time to join me. I just got an achievement slumming it. Uh, this is Mordheim Warband Skirmish, and we need to get to this uh, central location here. We're fighting a dev right now. So I uh, I was loading up the mission. I checked. We're currently leaderboard ranked um, 39. That is our current leaderboard ranking. Let me see if I can, can't turn the camera a little bit. Come on. Spam my mouse wheel. There we Did we get it? No, not quite. Come on. Yeah. Oh, uh, that'll work. Sure. Um, so I, I, uh, checked the leaderboard and we're ranked 39 and we are up against the saviors, which is the social media manager, uh, overwatch. It is his war band, um, with legendary games. So we'll see how we measure up against the devs here. Should be pretty good. Ragnar got robbed last episode, so he's not in proper attire. And I am recording this before the, uh, results of the, the voting are in and whatnot. Um, so you'll have to excuse me that I haven't yet implemented, um, different colors for, for my men, my merry men here, the mooses, more jacks and the mooses. Um, but nonetheless, we're soldiering on, seeing what we can do. We got a couple of flails now. I, I kind of like that with the, the charge effect that they give. Let's go right here. Le Kirk thrice poor. It really is cramping my style that I can't rotate properly. Come on. Come on. Well, whatever. Sorry, I'm going to stop freaking your camera out now. Uh, I'd like to go this way. That's good. We're going to approach it kind of from the top of the screen coming south. So the hope is that they'll string out to the left and to the right. But they're sticking together pretty well. I think in some ways, it's kind of funny, in some ways the AI almost seems a little bit better um, with this than, than City of the Damned, because in City of the Damned, the AI spreads out all over the place, which is tactically such a bad move. Um, so if you just kind of lay low and don't let them spot you for a little while, you can actually kind of catch, the, catch them with their pants down um, because they spread out so thin. So if you keep your guys together, you just have the upper hand, but... Uh, Let's run right here. LeKirk swapped out his little squashed hat for a pot helm, so he should be a little more defensy. Um, Morjax is gonna dangle his... There we go, the survivors. Oh, I'm sorry, it's the survivors, not the saviors. I've misled you. I told you that it was the uh, the saviors is is uh, Overwatch's band. So I <laughs> I've led you astray. I'm sorry for that. But I am but a mere mortal, and I, as as strange as it may seem, I do make mistakes. <laughs> Sometimes many of them. If you've watched my XCOM series, you know that I make many mistakes. <laughs> All right, let's just run right in there. This is going to be super. This moose is going to kind of dangle out here, see if we can't coax them. The AI might not engage. Uh, and it would be smart of the AI to do so. Is that within charging distance? That might just barely be, so we'll run right here. Uh, the AI would be smart just to sit in their little hovel, but um, they might be foolish enough to come and engage me. Hmm? They're just dirtling. Turtling and dirtling. Let's see if we can't coax this guy out. I want to tempt him. I want to tempt his tender vittles. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Okay, he is charging. Zero damage. That's a block, that little shield icon. So now we can swoop in and do some damage. Shank. And the two-handed. Please hit. Go, Lekirk, go! Two, injured. Wonderful, beautiful, glorious. Morjax is going to run right in there. We'll get our dude. So we could actually hide if they don't come after me. We could actually hide in this area and win just by having, by virtue of having more people in the, uh, in the victory zone. I think I might do that because it's, it's going to endanger us the least to do it that way, I believe. So I'm just going to one by one. Just casually, leisurely stroll into the victory zone. We've got five guys up. They've got two guys up. 
So I think all we have to do is simply wait it out. And if they charge at me, they're still outnumbered, so I think they're toast anyway. Stay put. I might run for that word stone right at the end. Bunch of my guys up here. This is a beautiful formation. Duh, I don't want to quite run for that yet. I'm going to go right here. And hope they don't spot me. All right. All right, all right. You move up one. Okay. So now, I don't know when it's going to roll the next round. So I'm just going to go ahead and grab this word stone right here. The survivors are surviving. Walked right there, man furious. That dude's almost certainly going to charge me, so I could, I could preempt him. Uh... But I shan't. I'll just move in a little bit closer. Because we're right about to win this as soon as it rolls to the next round, so... I'm kind of biding my time. I don't want to fight if I don't have to. Alright, Morjax is slow, so I'm gonna... Does this count as cover? Right there? Let's see if this gives us cover or not. It does. Wonderful. Aha! Uh -huh. He's going for the charge. He got two damage off. Oh, he's gonna drop! Of course, he always goes down. That's like a... It's like a national pastime. Alright, now we mean business. We're gonna just charge in and see if we can't do a little bit of damage. Oh, four! Dead! Achievement unlocked! Killer. I'm a killer queen, you guys. <laughs> this moose, get in there! So it's at the end of round eight. I, I mis miscalculated by a round. There's that. I don't know if more Jacks can get in there. What? After eight turns. Have more warriors after eight turns, and it's the ninth turn. So why doesn't it work? There we go. More Jacks knocked him out. The flail saved the day. I like that charge because it seems like you do a lot of charges. Combat doesn't tend to last that long, so... Maybe I'll keep an eye out for more, uh, more of those maces. Okay, Morjax got a level up. Good job, Morjax. Man Furious got also a level up. Wonderful. And a hand wound. Weapon skill penalty. <laughs> Ragnar's had a really bad string. Dismoose got a bit. Lekert got a bit. Ragnar's had a pretty bad time. All told. I wonder if we can dual wield those uh, shards for you? Sure. You're going to get one shards. The reason I'm doing that is because you get the most for selling one at a time. And then up over 7 or 11 or something like that, you get... Uh, it makes more sense to sell them all in one big lump. Okay, let us distribute Morjax's skill here. Um, he can get Strike to Injure, which is a plus 10% chance to crit. Uh, that's not going to help us. Let's see, what else can we get? We can't unlock any of these yet. We need... Weapon skill 50 for a lot of these. Uh, one extra attack? Yes, please. Beautiful. Beautiful. And, uh, yep, we can get one extra attack here, too. That is gigantic. That makes such a big difference. Um, and now Ragnar has a, a weapon skill penalty. Can we look at his injuries? <laughs> Hand wound, minus seven weapon skill, minus one wounds. Um, he's having a rough time. I might heal him maybe someday if I if he gets worse yet uh, Let me get another mission for us. Okay, we're gonna be going to the Memorial Gardens and engaging in the detestable Reichlanders Lamenters of more that sounds familiar I can't remember whose warband that is if you have Lamenters of more, please let me know uh, I shall fight you now Okay, here we are reach opposite edge Lamenters of more. Let's do it We've only got four, uh, four units in the battle. Now, this is something that's come up a couple times that people have mentioned to me uh, in the comments and on Twitter, um, that when 
when some of their units are injured, it's an unfair match. Like, if I only have two out of my five for some horrible reason, uh, that I'm going to be matched up against another warband of five, I really don't think that's the case unless it's been changed. Um, I do believe that it's matched to whatever you actually bring to the field is what the enemy, uh, is what the enemy has. Um, and if it's not, then it really should be that way. So I'm pretty sure that's the way it is. Uh, if you have any evidence or, or are able to confirm that is not the case, I would be extremely interested to know about that. Um, so I guess I can leave it at that. Um, but I'm pretty dang sure that the enemy matches the enemy warband with a little bit of wiggle room. Sometimes they're a little stronger, a little weaker. Uh, tries to match what you actually bring to the field. So that might not be true, but it was true at one point. Lamenters of more. Oh, he's got a pistol, hey? He's got a pistol. I'll show you what I think of your pistol. All right, they know where I am. I kind of want to get in cover and wait until they pop through these gates and then pounce upon them. That seems good. So LeKirk, uh, I swapped him out to a shield, which gives five parry and eight defense. That just seemed like a pretty sound thing to do. Um, I'm going to go right here. So Man Furious does not have line of sight to the enemy, but they can still see where we are. That seems good. Right, this dude's running up on us. And I'm gonna park Dismoose right here. That guy should be coming at us next round. Oh, they've got a long rifle too. I definitely want to stay in cover. I'm just gonna hide right about here, shall I? That seems pretty good. Man Furious, this guy's probably gonna come out. What? Give me a break. You can't see me through there. It's a fence. I didn't see it was a fence. Okay. At least they only did one damage. Charging. Critical. And the shoot. What? How can you see him? You hacksaw. Come here. I'm gonna spank you. Four. Critical hit. Wonderbar. Morjax is going to also come in for the charge. Please hit. No, the flail. Okay. And we get two attacks. I forgot about that. Yes! And I think that both first attacks count uh, as uh, as doing a bunch of damage there. So having two attacks and the flail is pretty tasty sauce for a charge. And once we are all in combat, they won't be able to... All right, Man Furious, do it, baby. Two attacks. Give me another one. Thank you, sir. May I have another? All right. All right. He's stunned. Now they can't shoot me as easily. Um, let's move right here and hide. And, uh, okay, so he's just leaving stunned condition. And we'll go right here. LeKirk should be able to trounce this guy. He is continuing to be stunned, so we get a nice big damage there. Great. And let me see if I can run out of their line of sight. I like that. Man Furious has already gotten shot and attacked once. Now I think, oh, he's going to get the... Mm, uh, mm, don't hit me. Mm, go, oh, oh. Okay, fine. Fine, fine, fine. Oh, he's trapped there now. Interesting. All right. Dismoose, you stay put. More jacks. You can run around here. I'm going to backpedal back to this gate. I kind of like that spot. You sneak right about here and then hide. Good. And then, Man Furious, you sneak up right there. Come to me. I don't really want to move. Well, I could expose everybody. Sure, this moose is going to be the bait to uh, expose where they are. Show yourselves! It's a shame I can't get a, a charge off on that. And Morjax can't quite make it there, which is also a bummer. So we'll tuck around the corner. 
I'm hoping we can bring them down below morale right here. Lekirk is coming in for the charge. Warriors may flee or fight poorly against a fear-causing enemy. Does he cause fear? That would suck if he does. Give me the charge, baby. Man Furious is scared. But we got at least two damage. Sigmar's with us, lads. So he's going to stay and fight. He's got just a little puny dagger. Really? He can shoot me because I'm not in combat, but I'm in melee range, which is... This makes me a little sad. All right, Morjax, you can't quite get there. Nor can I rotate. So let's run up to here. It's sort of confined quarters, which I have somewhat thrust upon myself. Second attack, take him down, baby. Oh, dang it. Okay, they still have to test for route. Continues to be sun. Sigmar, save us. That's it. That is a win. Ladies and gentlemen, two shards. Not great, not too bad. And on to our battle results. Morjax got a couple of points. Manfurious got nothing. Dismoose got nothing. Lekirk got a kill. And that's it. All right, my friends, we are in Black Pit Settlement up against the Flayed Men. We're at uh, full force today. Morjax is speedy, but his leg is smooshed as usual. You know, I think I might go back down. I might go down this little back alley here. I don't. I usually just run up this main corridor, and I I just am suddenly struck with the notion to do something a little different. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna run down the side road here, see what we can find. We did get a little bit of an upgrade. Morjax, uh, once you see the front of him, he got an upgraded shield, um, and also, uh, who is it? Um, I think it's Lekirk thrice poor. I got him a backsword, which is pretty good parry chance. I think it's like 20% parry chance if you have sword mastery. Uh, so the, the parry chance is pretty good. And then um, that's really the reason you'd get a sword is you've got your shield and then a little bit of extra defensive capability by using this. Oh, that's not what I wanted. All right, more jacks will just fall way behind. Whatever. Um... The buckler or the shield gives you some defense. The sword gives you the ability to parry as well. Uh, and, and so that's all for the good. And Morjax and uh, Manfurious both have two attacks and flail. So if they can do the charge and then get the attacks off, that's actually pretty dang tasty. Because the flails do double damage on the first round of combat, um, including if you have multiple attacks. So... If you're going for like a chargey build, that's kind of the way to go, is with uh, a whole bunch of attacks. Well, I mean, a bunch of attacks is always the way to go, but a bunch of attacks and then uh, and then the flails. Morjax is gonna hang his fanny out to dry here and tempt our enemies with our delectable, irresistible... Oh, May. Okay, they're going for the spears. Interesting. Ooh. That's a hired sword right there. They're going for spears so they can attack from one away. Uh, I don't like the hired sword. They are scary to me, precious. Um, I think I want to collect my forces. I'm going to run Morjax back into this alleyway and hope that I get there before they get to me. I think I will. But, uh might be a little bit <laughs> it might be a little bit close dismoos is gonna i'm just gonna uh, stage an ambush right here it's gonna be great All right more jacks hightail it out of there big guy they don't seem to have any ranged we can outrun them for at least one more turn which is really what we need to do i'm gonna park all my guys right here that's the hired sword in like full mail and the comet halberd and Ragnar, you stay put. I'm going to try not to let Ragnar die this time. Get taken out of action. I mean, in his defense, he hasn't died. Die died with a capital D. He's just been taken out of action every time. Come on. Come on, you cowards. They might just ignore me and run for the exit. All right, Morjax. Bait them back this way. Excellent. We're just going to slay and wait. Lay in wait and hope. 
for the best. I don't believe they can reach me on the next turn, so I'm going to be brave and stay put with my fanny in the alley. And if they run for the exit, um, that's fine. A, a bloodless loss is okay in Mordheim because you actually do get a little bit uh, from that. They might just be running straight for the exit. I'm going to, you know, no, I'm going to stay right here. I'm going to hope that some of them take the bait and run towards me. None may. Okay. We got, we got one interested party. Okay. Do we want to spring the trap? I think the answer is yes. Parry? Or block, rather. Charging! Oh! They can attack from two away. That's interesting with the spears. I haven't, uh... I haven't dabbled too much with the spears yet. One attack. Two attack! Yes! Out of action! Take that, hired sword! You blasted coward! Out of action! <laughs> oh, turnabout's fair play. Alright, go for the charge, Dismoose. Dismoose is charging... One damage. That guy's going for the exit. That's all right, because I'm going to go for the charge here. Two attacks with Morjax. And charging. Yes! Crit. Charging does extra damage. Out of action. Eight damage. So that was a swing for two and four, and it hit for four and eight. I think flails are kind of the best right now. Six injured! Oh, yes! Morjax and the mooses are unstoppable. And a parry. Thank you very much. And a block. Thank you very much. Oh, this is good. This is very good. I love it. Two damage. Give me another. Give me another, Man Furious. Two damage. You got to crit. All right, let's take this guy down and make him route before that the other guy can get to the exit. Dismoose. Oh, he blocked it. Okay. Steady, man. You better not make it to the exit. Okay, he didn't quite make it. So Morjax is going to come in for almost assuredly come in for the kill here. Can I not move that far? Really? Really? Really game? There we go. Three out of action. Thank you very much. Defeat! Oh. <laughs> we murdered everyone. We got five shards, but we lost because they made it to the exit. I'll take that loss. That was great. And that's the joy of Mordheim is that uh, you can have a lot. Like, that was probably my best match in a while, and it was a loss. I'm super happy with how that went. Um, <laughs> let's see, Ragnar. Blinded in one eye, ballistic skill penalty. Oh, poor guy. He is having a rough life in our warband. <laughs> so, Nosferatu Zod, I am very sorry about your unit that he just can't catch a break. Have you got shards for me? I'm not sure why he sounds like Deckard Kane. Okay, let's jump to the war camp here. Um, this is going pretty good, except for uh, Ragnar. I think he started with three life, and then he's just been injured down to two life. Uh, so he's having a, a pretty rough time of it, all told. Let's go skills. Three to seven. It didn't quite get us to 40 for the second attack. Um, let me know what you think so far. What are your favorite weapons? I'm really liking this flail. Actually, to that end, I would like to try to purchase a flail right now. Let me know if there's any uh, weapons that you're particularly liking. Here's a hammer we could buy. For, let's go ahead and splurge. Let's go ahead and get Ragnar the big-ass hammer a big-ass hammer. There you go. You better not get robbed again. I'm going to be miffed if you get robbed again. So that is all for now. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you, if you're playing this, that you are enjoying and your warband is having uh, good fortunes. That is all for now. Thank you for watching. I keep saying that again and again. See you next time.